traffic came to a standstill for miles on I-430 after a grass fire broke out on the side of the road. Our Gary Burton Jr. joining us live this evening to tell us what may have caused that fire and what people need to know so this won't happen again. Gary, what'd you find out? Well, as we know, the temperatures that we're experiencing are causing very, very, very dry conditions. And it only takes a small spark to ignite a big flame. And over on Interstate 430 at near Stagecoach Road, nearly 20 acres of land was burned and destroyed. Here's a sight that we're seeing more commonly, fire, as it's getting hotter and hotter. Approximately 20 acres were burned. Captain Jason Weaver with the Little Rock Fire Department says at around 2 p.m., units arrived on scene to I-430 near Stagecoach Road to extinguish the flames. The cause of the fire. What they're thinking right now is, is discarded smoking materials. Someone has thrown a cigarette out the window. Which is a big no-no with the dangerous dry weather conditions we're having. And as the fire burned, there were over 50 burn bans in the state. It's super hot, so everything's drying out. There's not a lot of humidity. We're not getting a lot of rain, so everything is super, super dry. It took crews about three hours to put out the fire. And an issue that they faced was water supply, as there wasn't a fire hydrant nearby, so they had to go back and forth to the fire department and around the backed up traffic to fill up their tanker. It was a concern the whole time. But they made it work and put the fire out. Captain Weaver says to look out for anything dragging behind your vehicle, like safety chains that can become extremely hot. Just a small spark can, can start a fire and it spreads really rapid. And another important tip to keep in mind to prevent a scene like this from happening anywhere. You don't want to park your vehicle in tall grass after you've been driving. The exhaust gets extremely hot and as dry as the grass is, if it's tall enough to, to get up around that that catalytic converter, it, it will light off. And another thing to look out for are fireworks. Captain Weaver, he says that there have been over 30 instances that the Little Rock Fire Department has been called out to work a grass fire associated with fireworks. And it's important to note that with the I-430 fire that happened today, there were thankfully no injuries. Live in Little Rock, I'm Gary Burton Jr., Fox 16 News.